I am going to make some potatoes today. These are Idaho or Russet potatoes and I'm going to bake them. These will be twice baked and I like to uh, use a little olive oil on the outside of them. And the olive oil helps that skin to crisp up. Next I'm going to fry up bacon. One half pound of bacon that I I chopped up a little bit. Well, I pretty much have my bacon crisped up. It's all kind of crispy. And I've moved it to the side of the pan. I'm going to get rid of some of the, uh, the grease, bacon grease here. Get rid of some of the oil. Okay. Move that back around. I'm going to add some green bell pepper. Oops, my timer. It means my uh, potatoes have cooked for an hour, that timer. And some chili. That's a little over a tablespoon of uh, chili. You can use jalapeno. I'm happy to be using Serrano. And we're going to cook the, the peppers up until they get fairly soft. Uh, while the chilies or the peppers are cooking with the bacon, I took my uh, uh, potatoes out to let them cool a bit. I'm also, uh, here I have half a package of cream cheese, four ounces. It's sitting, sitting out and becoming room temperature too. Well, next, after your potatoes have cooled off, you cut off like the top third or so of the potato and then you get that potato and put it into your bowl here and scrape it in there and hollow out your potatoes somewhat to where they kind of look like this. They still stand up and, and all like that. And so get all your potato into your bowl here. Well I've been taking my potatoes and kind of mashing them up with a fork and uh, like that I'm going to add my cream cheese, my soft and room temperature cream cheese and I'm going to add some sour cream. This is an 8 ounce container. I'm not going to use it all but I'm going to use most of it. I'll leave about that much left in it. I'm going to mix up the cream cheese and the sour cream. And if you can do that, you know that uh, your cream cheese is soft enough. All right. Then I'm going to add the bacon and chilies. that in there. And here's some cheddar cheese that I grated up. And some Romano cheese that I grated up. And some salt. And some uh, green onion tops. A little pepper in there. And mix this all up to where it's pretty well combined. And oops, I almost forgot a half a cup of heavy cream. Well, I have my uh, potatoes filled up. And I'm going to put these back in my oven. And I turn my oven down to 350. And they'll bake for oh, 25 minutes, check them at 30, 25 minutes, maybe 30 minutes. Here they are out of the oven and you can take a little bit of paprika if you wish, some paprika and sprinkle over the top of them just to make them kind of look purdy, a little bit better, a little bit nicer. Not that much. Just do it carefully. 
kind of like that. Maybe a little more on this one. And these are ready to serve right away. They're really, really good. I have my potato plated up. It goes with just about anything. And I've cut into it. You can see it's just has a nice look to it and it's just wonderful. Mm, it's so good. Thanks so much for watching.